next video in today's video i will show you how to do uh, augmented reality as well as 3d model viewing uh, in an extremely easy way for ios unfortunately this video is only for ios if you want to see the android video please support my channel by subscribing and once i am able to monetize my channel i will buy a new android phone with the air capabilities and uh, my do a video as well on that so yeah uh, so let's get started uh, before that I will just show you guys the output so I have already done augmented reality stuff previously but this is little bit different so this is for quick look so there is a button uh, open here quick look when I click on that button it opens a quick look window and here you can see uh, this 3d model is trying to render in real world so I am able to render it so this is a 3d model as you can see and the tab is AR uh, and there is another tab in the same screen itself uh, called uh, object and once you click on object you can uh, locate uh, that 3d model like how it looks and we don't have to code all of this by ourselves Apple does a great job in you know quickly uh, allowing us to view this file in both augmented reality as well as in 3d space so yeah let's get started so here i have created a flutter project and inside that i have created a method channel called er quick look platform and inside that i have just created a text button and uh, i am calling that method channels method called uh, qr quick look uh, sorry this should be er quick look but anyways whatever string you have defined it on the dart side should be the same on uh, native side as well and uh, yeah actually i am not sending any result back but you can just invoke this method uh, that should be okay uh, next uh, open the main ios folder in xcode and here first of all uh, make sure uh, you uh, uh, change the ios version to at least 13 and uh, in ios deployment target as well as 13 next inside uh, info.plist uh, you have to add this privacy camera permission and I have added a 3d model of this so first of all you can download any 3d model uh, from Google uh, but uh, that 3d model should be in the format of USDZ only uh, it should not be in OPG or FBX and GLTF uh, that kind of format because uh, by default Apple only supports a USDZ format uh yeah of course it is possible to support other 3d formats as well but you will have to write that code for it uh, which i don't know how to do so yeah i am just following apple's recommendation of uh, including any kind of a 3d model which is in usdz format next inside app delegate dot swift all you have to do is um, you have to first create your flutter view controller and you have to import quick look and uh, extend this to um, classes delegate and data source and then you have to override these two methods from those two classes so i am returning one over here and whatever is the name of your 3d model so mine is teapot so write that with the extension of uhdc next inside whenever that method is called so here you can see i have defined the method channel and this is the method name qr quick look and inside that we are just launching ql preview controller which is a quick look preview controller and that handles everything for us so yeah that's it thank you for watching bye